felt very proud of you with the strength that you have shown our community and our schools. I know that all the students are rooting for you and we just hope that you feel better and you're back to school doing what you love. Hey Lisa! Hi Lisa! I think you are the most deserving person I know and so I want to wish you health and happiness because you deserve it. Um, good luck! I wish the same. You're just so courageous and I'm just proud to know you and honored to know you. Um, you just fought so hard and I just wish you many, many more years of health and happiness. Bye Lisa! We love you! Love you! Hi Mrs. Mayor. I just wanted to talk to you a little bit about how inspiring you are uh, to our students at, at GMS. Um, I know I don't know you really well, but I have been inspired by how you've handled the situation, how you carry yourself. Uh, you are the definition of grace under pressure. You're the definition of grace in, in the public. Um, you are a great inspiration to our students, and I thank you for that. I haven't known Mrs. Mayor for very long, but I found out pretty quick she's a very, very awesome teacher. One tough cookie battling uh, cancer. Still coming to school teaching. Love you a lot, Mrs. Mayor. Best wishes. Keep kicking butt. Lisa, we are so proud of you. You have been so strong and an inspiration to all of us. We love you so much. Hang in there, girl. We're, we've got your back. Hi, Lisa. Get to feeling better soon. Hey Lisa, stirring up with good measure for you to get well soon and looking forward to your return. Bye. Lisa Mayer is one of the most inspiring, encouraging people to work with. And her inspiration has been for everybody's benefit. Her encouragement, everyone looks up to Lisa here in this building. I think everyone in the community Hello, Mrs. Mayor. Um, you are a wonderful person, and I hope to be like you when I grow up. Hi, Mrs. Mayor. Um, I just want to say how she's affected me. She's very positive, and she's welcomed me as her partner teacher. And so, uh, I'm really proud to say that I get to work with her every day. Small but mighty. Keep staying strong. We, we love, love you, Mrs. Mrs. Mayor. Mayor. Hello, I want to wish the very best to Mrs. Maynard. She is definitely a highlight of Erie Elementary with her great attitude and her great smile. Wishing her the best. Okay, I think it was John Wayne that once said, um, courage is being scared to death but saddling up anyway. And uh, I think that pretty much sums up uh, how Lisa has uh, fought this battle. Um, she may be small, but she's mighty, and she's been a great inspiration to all of us here at Erie Elementary, and we just love her and want her to know that we love her and support her through all this. Thank you. Um, Lisa Mayer has just been an outstanding person for me. I remember um, when I came here for my interview, she was sitting right next to me and um, telling me all these really hard-hitting questions, and I thought, holy cow, this woman is very in intimidating. And then I got to know Lisa, and she is just the sweetest, most kind, caring person in the world, and would do anything for anybody. We love you, Lisa. Hi, Lisa. It's us out here in the speech room, and just wanted to let you know that we're thinking about you, and we hope that things turn out great for you. Lisa, thank you so much for your inspiration as you win your battle with cancer. Your life is an example to our students, our community, and to all those that are involved you. Good luck. Keep it going. Hey, special lady. Looking forward to seeing your smiling face back here at work. See you soon. This is Mayor. I tell you what, it isn't it very often I get to hang out with heroes, but when I hang out with you, you're a hero. Way to beat this thing. We love that you're just working it. So keep it up and we're looking for you full time back, ready to rock. Love you. Hey Lisa, it's Kelly. I just wanted you to know that I admire this battle you've been going through. You've fought it with um, courage and laughter and hope, and you are and have been certainly in my prayers. So well done, my friend. What an inspiration you are to us, Lisa, um, for this whole long process that you've gone through. You've always been positive, you've always had a smile on your face, and you've always had a kind word to say to everybody. Uh, you've been an amazing role model for all of us. Uh, keep your chin up and keep healing. 
Mrs. Mayor, we love you. The entire school loves you. The entire community loves you. It's behind you 150%, and we know that you're just going to kick cancer's butt, so we love you. Lisa, it's been a wonderful time, wonderful time to work with you. You're such a good teacher. You care so much for the kids. Wish you luck, and my prayers are with you with this time that you're having with your cancer. You're such a strong person, and I know everybody looks up to your strength and your love. We just want to wish you the best. Congratulations, Lisa, on beating this thing. We love you. Hang in there. You got it, girl. Oh, Mrs. Bear. Uh, the love that we have for you is unmeasurable. Uh, you've been an inspiration to everybody, showing us how you can just deal with the situation head on with grace charisma, you're just amazing. You're our hero. We love you. Hi, Lisa, take care of yourself. It's been a joy working with you. If, uh, if it wasn't for losing your hair because of chemo, I wouldn't know anything was wrong with you. You're a tough little, little thing and, a, and an excellent teacher. Take care of yourself. Lisa, you're one of our biggest heroes. You're so strong. We idol, idolize you and we love you. I worked with you for the past 13 and a half years, and it's been a joy and a privilege. You're an inspiration to us all, and we love you. This is me, you're one of the most inspiring people and teachers I've ever met. Thank you for everything. Hi, I'd just like to thank you for showing my daughters this year what true strength really means. We love you. Mrs. Mayer is one of the strongest, bravest women that I know, and I admire her and just love her. Um, she has always put herself um, second to others. She puts other people first and never has once complained about all of the tough times that she is going through. And I just love her and admire her. Hey Lisa, this is Jill. I hate cancer, cancer sucks. But you're tough and you can beat this and it's gonna be history. Hey Mrs. Mayor, keep fighting, you got this. Mrs. Mayor, we love you and keep strong. Hey, Mrs. Mayor, uh, I just wanted to mention to you that we're all thinking about you and also that uh, you've been such an inspiration to, to my students. Um, they oftentimes mention you, as we've discussed. Um, but for me personally, just to see your attitude and uh, your exuberance, your smile, uh, is always something that lifts my day every time I see you. So we're pulling for you. Uh, hi, Lisa. Um, it's really great to uh, see how uh, much of an inspiration you've been, and uh, it's always great to be around you. Uh, you're very bright and cheerful, and uh, I've, I've been really inspired to see how you've been uh, fighting this, and uh, you're in our thoughts and prayers, and uh, we, hope you, we hope you come through this, and uh, just keep it up. Lisa, you are the most amazing person that I've ever met that makes such an amazing difference in the lives of others. Thank you for everything you've done. We love you. We know you're going to get better. Keep fighting. Hey Lisa, wishing you the best. Lisa, I wish you well. You know, but if, when you get all over this, you'll probably have hair back and I won't. I don't know if that's proper. Love you. Lisa, we are so blessed to have you as our youth group leader. We love you, Lisa!